Students in Blair Middle School's future problem solving class had the opportunity to participate in the Vice Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff STEM Challenge. For the challenge, students designed towers made out of paper and tape that had to hold a can of vegetables for one minute. They had three weeks to come up with a design, a prototype, and a final project. We've done quite a few of these engineering challenges within the class. However, these materials seem to be posing a, a challenge to them. So it's been interesting to see how they're overcoming those challenges, problem solving, sh uh, troubleshooting, and thinking about what they know about structural engineering, which is very little, but they do have some good ideas. I thought it was like going to be easy from the start, but uh, like when I found out that we had limited tape, it was kind of hard because limited tape uh, and paper. We just we only had 30 pieces of paper to use, and that's it. And we had to like make it tall, but somehow use less paper because the less paper, the better, and the taller, the better. Yeah. Vice Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, Admiral Christopher Grady, and his wife Christine came to Blair to judge the structures. The admiral went from team to team, talking with students about their towers and tallying scores for each of them. Winners were announced at the end of the visit, but it's the experience itself that will stay with these students. It was really cool, but when he came to test it out, it was pretty nerve-wracking. Like, it was like, oh, we were all like shaking, but it's really cool afterwards just to see someone that high up, like come in and do something for us and take the time to do it. They all did a great job. Uh, they all worked. And we had such a diversity of designs and they all, they all worked. It was fantastic. Mr. Knight, what he has done and what this school has done to inspire the idea of solving wicked hard problems, which this young generation is going to have to do, his mission is way more important than mine. And so I give him all the credit in the world.